going to do a little video here. Uh, Celestron, as uh, it's been discovered and reported on cloudy nights, that Celestron has recently developed a CGX-L mount that is probably going to be the replacement for the CGE Pro. And uh, here on Cloudy Nights, I've got a post up here that was on the cache page for Google. The post has been deleted on Cloudy Nights, but I still found it here where we've got a Steve GR just ran across this on Celestron site. There is another variant to the CGX mount with a 75 pay, pound payload. Mentions this is interesting. So, War Graphics comes in and says it's a good catch, and there's some discussion on here. And uh, but in looking at this, when we come back to uh, Cloudy Nights the next day, uh, this post had been censored and deleted on Cloudy Nights. So they uh, they pulled the the post, and apparently. Uh, Celestron had placed this information on the CGX-L equatorial mount and tripod uh, information and they hadn't released this, really released this to the public yet so they ended up uh, taking this down. But uh, what we've got here information that says with the introduction of the CGX in 2016 now comes its bigger brother, the CGXL, sharing the benefit of an exceptional low capacity to weight ratio. The new CGXL takes equatorial mounts to the next level with a low capacity of 75 pounds. So this is higher than the CGX that was with a 55 pound rating. And uh, but let's see what else we've got here. Uh, showing more information on this. Uh, the mount appears to be an upgraded version of the CGX. And they're mentioning that compared to the CGX, the CGXL has improved motors to provide more torque, better slewing, and tracking under heavy loads. It has a heavy duty belt drive system to minimize backlash while providing smooth motor operation under heavy loads. And uh, I got a little picture of the smoother belt system. It's got a larger 144 millimeter diameter worm wheel uh, to better and more accurately drive heavier loads. So I guess this mount will be better than the CGX. Uh, features a lot of the, the uh, features of the CGX. Uh, it appears to be, looks almost like the same uh, mount. It's got uh, home and limit sensors on it and uh, dual dovetail tail saddle. It will include a larger tripod and uh, an accessory tray. Uh, but the CGXL appears to share a lot of the features of the uh, CGX. Let's see what else we have here on the page since we're here. Uh, specifications. So here on our specification we got a 75 uh, pound weight limit, larger tripod. Uh, the equatory head weight is 52 pounds as opposed to the uh, the CGX, which is only 42 pounds, I believe. And uh, so, looks like the CGE Pro is going to be replaced. And I guess this is an upgraded, uh, higher quality version of the CGX. Again, uh, this has been deleted off Celestron's website, but we got the catch page, so we're going to go ahead and uh, put this up. And... Uh, the post that was on cloudy nights has been renewed so what uh, here's the story we'll go ahead and post this up hope everybody enjoys